Hello everybody and welcome back to the channel and we are back now if you've been wondering where we've gone and you hadn't seen the community post we'll just get this out of the way now and we'll say it. me and Chelsea are no longer together Chelsea has now moved out she has moved out with Winston so Winston is no longer here so it's just me Pablo and Stanley now I don't want to say anything more on the matter than that she's not here so I can't say anything without giving her an equal opportunity to say something as well so that's basically all you guys need to know it's between us as I said in the post, we are still amicable, we both still want the best for each other. Obviously, Winston's still with her, so I want to make sure he's okay. So we don't hate each other, we haven't burnt bridges, it just is what it is. So if you want to go see what Winston's up to, then go follow her on Instagram. I'm sure she'll be posting loads with him and what she's doing and stuff. So if you want to keep up to date with them, go follow them over there. Winston is a very special dog. I've never seen a dog with as much love to give in my life. He is just such a good little natured dog and yeah, I just hope that he's okay. But he's fine, I'm getting updates on him and he's settled in well and he's calmed down and he seems a bit less stressed and his armpits are clearing up and everything so it's it's going well for him and I'm, I'm glad. So a lot has been going on in the previous months and that's why content has been very low or just completely non-existent so that's what's been happening. Now we didn't want to split the boys up, that was never an ideal situation, we didn't know what we were doing, it took a long time to decide what we were going to do, there was a lot of thought involved, a lot of things going into it, but long story, very short, Winston was a mommy's boy so he went with her, he is now with Louis so there's now two of them together, Stanley and Pablo stayed with me so there's now two of them together, so each of them has a friend at their respective locations and that's the longest of story shorts and how we decided on how it was going to go. Now I know people want a lot more details and more answers but for now that's all I'm willing to part with. I know we've opted to basically share our lives online with you guys but there are stuff that is personal that we would like to keep to ourselves and this is one of them things so I hope you guys can respect that. So then what's going to be happening with the channel and what are we going to be doing going forward because obviously now it's just me and these two little tinkers. Stanley? Yeah, see them both there. Well number one we need to start getting content out to you guys, start filming some stuff. It's getting dark, it's raining all the time so we're going to have to do stuff in the house which is never ideal but we're going to be switching to more like vloggy style things, just things we're getting up to, things we're doing. Now I don't want to get up to that much so it'll probably be more the dogs and that's how it's always realistically going to be. My life is the dogs so it still ends up being the dogs so don't worry. But we're heading into winter which means the weather's going to be quite bad, cold, raining and all stuff like that so I have got a solution. New GoPro, and that is a dog harness, so we can get some POV dog things. So this will probably end up being my more dominant used camera. As you can see, this camera is massive, it's not waterproof, so it's really hard getting this thing out and doing like vlogs or taking it places. It's always quite an effort taking this thing around. Whereas this is tiny, it's waterproof, it's 4K, it's probably actually as good as this camera now because of the technology, this is quite an old thing, this is new, so this probably will look a bit better. And we can go out, we can do some outside filming in the rain, and your walks and stuff, yeah. So we need to get that all set up, we're gonna do that. So that'll allow us to film a lot more because lumping this thing around, and obviously when people see a camera this big and walk around with it, it's, it's very attention drawn and I'm not, I don't really like attention, right? I'm very, I'm very introverted, so pulling the camera out in public is like my worst nightmare. So on top of that, I'm going to be looking at trying to get some like maybe brand deals and some stuff like that, because I've never really done it before. I've always kind of stayed clear of it because I didn't think I needed it. But currently, I'll tell you now financially, it's going to be difficult over the next few months for sure because obviously the channel's just not been doing well. So I could do with the support from maybe some brands and things like that. So I'll look into all of that stuff. So if that's how to appear on the channel, you know why. I've obviously got the full house to pay for now by myself. And GoPros aren't free. So yeah. And on that, I at some point I will be setting up Patreon because you guys have offered to support the channel many times before financially. And I appreciate everybody offering that. And I always said I would never do it unless I really needed it. So I'm going to be set up. Because the last thing I want now is to lose the house. That's the last thing I want to do. So the goal is just to make sure I can stay in here with the boys and keep a roof over their head and keep them fed and keep them hungry. Keep No, keep them fed and not hungry. I just want to be able to offer something in return to you guys that doesn't take away from everybody else because I still want to be able to give everyone all the content for free. I don't want to pay you all anything, but I want to be able to give you guys something in return. I'm just trying to figure what that is. And all this stuff will be gradually brought in over time, so I will let you guys know when I eventually set this up. And sorry if I'm a bit rusty, it's been a long time since doing this, and I apologise this video is long, but let's just get everything out of the way now, and it's done. And we'll just up all the social media games, Instagram, I'm learning how to do like the stories on that, so you can get more and more like 
up to date real life what is going on and things behind the scenes of filming and all things like that. I'll try to post more on my Instagram, my own channel. I'm probably not going to do anything with it. I would really love to, but I'm just going to concentrate fully on this first and then maybe get that up and running in the future. Streaming, I would really like to do. I do have a Twitch, so if you want to go subscribe over there, I'll leave the link somewhere. But the internet here is so bad that it's very difficult to actually do and set up, but that is something I would love to do. Because you enjoyed the streams on here and I do love just randomly chatting to you guys and just sitting, playing games, chatting and you can come in and speak to us and stuff and it'll be just really cool. So I want to set that up, I'll set like a day and some times or something. But again, that's just something for the future. TikTok, now that's something I just don't really use as a platform. I watch them all the time but I watch them on Instagram when they're reposted so I don't really understand how TikTok works. I'm going to learn how that is. I've got like a few video ideas, I've got two video ideas for that. So I might start using that. But I want to try and keep as much content on YouTube because I know content creators I watch, they're on like a few different platforms and I only really watch them on YouTube. I don't follow them really anywhere else. And I understand a lot of people are like that. So to keep my content on YouTube, what I'm going to be doing is setting up a second Pablo channel and it'll be like a clips channel. So I'll post clips from the YouTube videos from here before other people are doing because clips channels are really popular. So I'll do that. But then also I'll post on there the TikToks, I'll post on there if there's any funny like Instagram stories to do and stuff. So I'll try and keep it all on YouTube so everyone on YouTube can just keep on YouTube and they don't have to be on TikTok and this and this and this. I'll just try and condense it all down and put it on that second channel and then we'll keep the main videos here. So that's the basic plan of everything I kind of want to do and get going. Now in terms of long term future, I have no idea. I don't know whether this will continue, whether I'll keep doing this, whether I'll get another job again and just start doing this part time and like reduce this right down. I'd love to keep this going, but if I can't, I can't, it's as simple as that. But all my time and effort will be going into this and this alone. I've got no plans for anything else going on in my life. I just want to get myself sorted, get the boy sorted, get us in a place where we are comfortable, happy, financially stable. That's all I want currently, that's, that's all I'm aiming for. So if you guys can like and comment on the videos and stuff, that would just help us out massively. And yeah, I think I've talked enough this video and I apologize, I'm very rusty at this. I'm just spurting to the camera. I should really think about what I say more before I put a camera in front of my face, but that's just how it is. You get it as it is, you get me as me, and that's it. So thank you guys so much for your patience and obviously all the messages you have sent myself and Chelsea over the past couple of weeks and stuff after you found the news out it's been amazing and I honestly the reason I'm still doing this is from the messages I didn't realize how much these videos impacted people's lives I resonate with a lot of them comments you send me when I wasn't particularly happy or I wasn't feeling too good videos from certain content creators really made me happy I was looking forward to them I couldn't wait for the videos and I just didn't realize people like my videos like that it just it just didn't occur to me so going forward i want to be there to support you guys because now i'm being in the same situation and i get these videos are just an escape for some people and you love seeing them so these two little tinkers here are the future so get used to seeing these these are very pretty these are very pretty boys yeah you're very pretty boys you very pretty boys. Very pretty. So I really appreciate you guys, especially you who are still here now watching the end of this video of me just rambling on. Um, but that's going to be it for this video. So we will see you very soon. Peace out.